opposite man. But if you watch who recently played for the Harambe Stars in their match against Togo, has now just taken over the number one jersey from Samuel Odiambo. A healthy competition between these two keepers in the Tusker side. Looking to shoot, Kepaswani. Oh! He gets to him, he tees himself up as the ball bounces once and shoots. It's going beautifully downwards. Boniface Oloch had to be really, really at the top of his game to get a finger on that one. He had to bounce be really for United. And lucky bounce for Tasca that gets uh, Boniface Oloch in trouble. Joseph Kuria floats it, but uh, all is well at the back with Boniface for Arita. A header from Mandela. And oh, Boniface Oloch just saving it. From being a corner, good play by Kepa Kepa Swani. Kepa Swani shoots. Oh, great save by Watch. Yeah, he didn't have a chance. I mean, it looked like absolutely nothing. Then he picks his spot, he figures it's not too far from the goal, goes for the near post. Take it second. quickly. Miheso floats it. <laughs> a free kick in favor of Kick United. Floated it, but uh, easy pickings for both. Most likely the tallest man in the Kenya Premier League altogether. Two tiers of players of checking. And now the chance there! Oh! One person watch had to be big and puts it! Mayhem in the goal in the top. Obvious free kick, but this is a chance by Goruma here. Quick counter attack. That was a lovely, lovely chip. Body first of watch had to be sharp to come in and even sharper to realize that he was already out of his box. Fantastic chip by uh, Baldungwa, but Boniface Alwatch showing good keen yeah, sense. Okot helping in defense as well, but Ali Abondo, Ali Abondo will know Okot very well. Okot, good catch. The Tusker wall, the big man, shot, oh, Boniface Alwatch had to be at his best. Yeah, he does well to get that. Uh, the free kick is from quite a distance, and so he gets the distance on it, and he gets the accuracy, but that's Gorma here playing in the... Um, in the 1979 African Cup Winners' Cup. Wow. Wow, crossing. Oh, Boniface the watch. Just managed to get his fingertips through Yeah, that was dangerous. Nice cross by Baldwin. All watch decides just but he pumps it behind his head. He couldn't see where. Almost under five minutes. Boniface the watch. Confidence at the back. This was straight to the hands of Boniface Oloch from the midfield and Arista for Tusk memory together with the fact that uh, Olenzi are the 22 to capitalize on the free kick. They don't come it in and I think it's already been taken but the shot is a good one. It catches the goalkeeper from us of God. I think it should be a goalkeeper. Here it comes again, the shot carried off by the goalkeeper. Well, he's had it actually touched outside. But the whistle went, I think, for offside. And actually, when we look at Bonfast making the fast ball, then off him, we have some two or three Olenzi players in that position. And I think that is what uh, the referee has called for the offside. Well, let's look at the finer details of it. And I think what if was a lot shambling. And he knew he couldn't get to that ball. Brilliant play by the task of side. And, uh, the 22nd minute of the game have the ball possession, yes, but uh, how many goals he scored because that is what counts the game for the game. Right foot by Lindsay to o Ochola, and the shot, uh, that's the kind of save that comes with uh, this goalkeeper. Uh, look at Ochola, he goes through that and the task of heavy space and the ball pass was just brings it across, lovely chesting, the shot is up. Uh, on purpose, they would like a goal and uh, from whichever position, Jacob. A good play here by Olenzi and uh, true to their name here, they are trying to shoot from score. They have been in that goal uh, area for a couple of times. Pushing and shoving with Ochoba. Oloch is off his line and timed that very well. He's picked it up. This is a statement of fact. This one, Ochoba again. 
and a part uh, the control but not the last touch and uh, Chama should have turned it in with okay, first okay, touch yeah, uh, okay, uh, I think he's got to learn by now but the first uh, touch is on the team is the Olinzi stars it could have been the Olinzi superstar situation this one straight into the hands of Bonifazo they begin the build up into the midfield the back kill was very nice Kevin Ouma and then the shot here goes straight ah, to the hands of uh, Bonifazo Lodge. And that's the final whistle, Bonifazo Lodge. Well, Emperor. you are the DSTV man of the match today, so we want to give you a DSTV walker, um, which is handheld television. You can watch the Kenyan Premier League when you're somewhere else and uh, enjoy the game. How do you feel? Olochi, Adi Olochi, Harris Marba Farid, 